Hey guys, Mighty Gazelle here, back with more Watch with Mighty Jujutsu Kaisen. This is season two, episode eight, titled Shibuya Incident. Um, I st I struggle with the numbering on these because Crunchyroll does the whole thing where this is like thirty two total, but um, yeah, Shibuya Incident, the name of this arc that we're on, Shibuya. Uh, my goal today, uh, as well as I'm gonna watch some JoJo. Uh, and then I'll, don't worry, I'll get to Demon Slayer. Those of you who are waiting for Demon Slayer, uh, I want to catch up with this first. I'm only two behind. I think a new one just dropped yesterday. So yeah, there's only two for me to catch up on, on Jujutsu, Jujutsu Kaisen. And then, uh, then I'll do some Jojo and then I'll start with Demon Slayer probably tomorrow. Um, so yeah, uh, thank you guys for joining me and I'm excited to see what this is all about. I mean, like. Shibuya, like everyone's saying this is like the best arc of Jujutsu Kaisen, and uh, this is the name, Shibuya Incident, so I can only assume that just a lot of shit goes down with fighting and whatnot. Uh, we, we ended off with Gojo uh, approaching the veil, and uh, I presume he's just going to go in and try to clean up whatever's going wrong. So, yeah, uh, I'm excited. Link in the description if you want the Patreon version, hitting record on that now. Just an option if you want to support the channel. And uh, yeah, let's begin in three, two, one, go. Oh, they're using military time. So this would be like 8 p.m., 8.30? All these people in costumes. The hell are some of these costumes? Two veils. Oh, this is that famous. Uh, I've seen this like this is like a really famous like meme or something, right? Where he's walking across the people. Oh, excuse me, don't worry. It looked a little different than that though. I had seen that before. Someone. That's like a famous meme. Not I don't know a meme, but famous panel. I'll play along. I understand the logic. Yeah, he's a god. <laughs> what the hell? What the heck? He is a big shot. ordinary woman yourself yeah you wear a braid in front of your head oh you know what i had heard there's a very strange relationship between these two they're like brother and sister even even you just like what the fuck <laughs> i love that part of you okay yeah <laughs> it is a little creepy i won't lie i'm kind of on board with what you just thinking I love how it completely blocks her face. Like, it's not practical. And it's not really stylish either. It's just to stand out. We're running. How fast can they run? He can run pretty fast. How fast can they run? Look at this fool. Just floating wherever he wants. And he can already tell they're there. Oh, is it? Oh, it's it's the oh a new guy. I don't recognize the third one, bro. Last time he whooped your ass, he carried your head around like a trophy. Look at this awesome intro. I really do like this intro. That no, none of the intros have been bad for this series. Um, if I had to pick a favorite intro, I. Season one intros were really good. I won't lie. This one's, this one's, ah, it's, it's got some zest to it. I like it. The only one that's undisputable is the first outro of season one. It's still, it's not only the best in this series, it's like among the best ever that I've seen. I've said that many times. I won't repeat myself, but. Oh, 
What's the plant uh, demon's name again? The plant spirit. The one that him and Toto fought last season. I forgot. That, that's one of my favorite characters. Um, it's also interesting because it's a girl. It sounds like a girl. But I guess demons can be like... They don't have to have a gender. It's just They just are. They're, you know, they're like a... It's not even a gender. It's just like an energy that they are. The vibes I get from the intro is that a lot of people are going to die. Like, probably people we know well, too. What a strange team, by the way. These two have like never really interacted. So it's, don't get me wrong though. I like that. I like pairing different people who normally wouldn't be together. I like that. I'm not complaining. It's just like strange to me. That guy had feet for hands. Wait, hold up. What? Okay. I need to hear what, what triggered Yuji. To, uh, sorry, I rewinded a bit. Oh, so he he knows Mahito is probably here. He, uh, he's man, that's so fucked up what he did to Yuji's friend last season. The friend of dude, he befriended him and everything, and then like just killed his mom and then killed him. That's so cool. She can use like the birds to yeah. These sorcerer abilities are so fun. I don't mind if you talk. <laughs> she says it's fine. <laughs> what are they carrying around? It looks like a gun. Oh, shit. R.I.P. Bird, I guess. Oh, that's her axe. Never mind. No, I forgot she uses an axe. Hmm. Oh shit. Hmm. All right, we get to see some Yuji fighting. I hope. Patch face. <laughs> I love people just come up with the nicknames for their rival, their villains, you know. Patch face. That's a little basic, but it's good. Oh, you're a backup. Okay. Can the can the little brother fight? I don't know much about the relationship. I just know people on Twitter and stuff were having a big discourse about it. Like, like it's kind of creepy. I assume they're alluding to things that happened in the manga, but I don't really know that stuff. Uh-oh. Ew, uh, is he eating someone? 
Yep. Oh, God, he ate his head. It's like a praying mantis, dude. Ew. Get him, Yuji. Get his ass. Jujujuku. Jujuku. <laughs> Don't worry, I struggle with that all the time, too. Jujutsu Kaisen. <laughs> I'm clever. Come on, Yuji has to be able to take this guy, right? I always remember we're going to taught him. Cool. Though I'm both strong and capable, of course. Oh, it's that. Oh, it's that nail. They had, they had that in the uh, they showed that in the last episode. That's what happened. That's what made the veil, huh? If you can, I wonder if it's protected. Yeah, yeah, bro. Cue to five seconds from now when you're dead. Yeah, bop. Boom. Get wrecked, dog. You stupid bug. <laughs> you know, what I like about Yuji is you can't say he's like crazy unique, but I just love his like energy, his positivity. But he also is not afraid to get mad when he needs to. I don't know. I, I like it. Like, I want more of him. We didn't really get a whole lot as much as I thought in the first season, but... I guess this is a show, though, where it's not all about one character. <laughs> that offend him that much. We're focusing on that a long time. What? It's clever. I love this little transition. Like chime? Has that made chimes? Or what, what instrument would that be? Okay, so he's a locust. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, gross. Ew. Well, that's why they introduced pesticide. <laughs> cool. What the hell? Did he grow he grew extra arms? The animation's looking weird here. I don't know if I'd call it bad, but it's like the the way they're focusing on it is like strange. What the heck? Did they just like repeat the same shot almost? What? <laughs> he probably doesn't have any tricks. He's a big dummy. He ain't clever. I do not care about this bug guy. Can we just get to the Yuji killing him?
I love you have Gojo out here fighting like the big bad people three on one, and then you have him who's like having this epic battle against Bugman. Okay. Boom. Okay. This looks kind of lame, not going to lie. <laughs> it, they do the thing where they... Oh my god. Well... You guys should know that I'm brutally honest sometimes. This is not as impressive as most of the season has been. They do the thing, they do that thing where they like just blur it a bunch and make it super sketchy. But eh, I don't care. I don't care about this bug guy, so you know what? It's almost better that he gets a lame death. Ew, don't let him spit on you. Yeah, dodge that gross shit. Go for the punch. Still the more clever one. Ew. Oh, he's pulling like a cell. He's going to stab you. Ah, ew, gross dog. What the fuck? Oh, my God. Ew, he got the blood all over him. This guy's so gross. Just die already. Oh! Wow, right on the nail. That's your axe, yeah. That that's such a cool weapon. Oh, he's praying for the people that he ate. Wow. Oh, Mojito. Bro, that bug was not that... Any basic sorcerer could have killed that fool. <laughs> I like him. He's a, he's a very... whimsical villain. You don't see that very often. Again, am I the only one that's not, like... I feel like most people could have beaten that bug guy. Not with too much issue. He didn't seem that strong. <laughs> Thank you, I'm honored. <laughs> Alright. I wonder if we'll get any of Gojo's fight this episode. Uh-oh. Nah, uh, something's fishy here. Oh, she's just, like, in shock or something. Oh, yeah, we are getting some Gojo. Oh, shit. <laughs> That's all <we're laughs> what the heck? They're out of playset? What the hell? What a strange setting for these guys. About to blow some bubbles. I think those are the bubble things. It's Waldo! I found Waldo! Whether you run or not, we're gonna kill him. Oh, shit! Get back or you'll die. He says it so calmly. <laughs> yeah, he's blowing bubbles. And why are they blowing bubbles on this like playground? That, we're gonna have our secret evil meeting at this this tree fort playground. And yep, he's just setting people on fire. Oh my god, he ripped that guy's head off. Oh my. Is Gojo not gonna stop this? He's just blood manipulation. 
Oh shit! Is this gonna kill everyone behind him? Look at him! They think they're gonna land hits on Gojo? What is this? Cue to them just getting blocked with the barrier. Oh, pop. Oh. So basically, oh, we have all these innocent people around. He won't go as hard. Like, that's their thought. Oh, interesting. Let's see how Gojo handles it. The heck there's uh, mojitos out there <laughs> uh, he's jumping around with the kids what the fuck yeah he's like yeah they're laughing uh, what did you expect oh oh no they're doing the domain okay huh He's not even worried. He just teleports out. Gojo's so freaking strong, dude. He just like doesn't even care. He's just like, meh. What a lame attempt at them trying to kill him. They should know he's just a god. Oh. Oh. Huh. So it lets you go through the barrier? Oh. Oh, so again, with the whole people situation. Okay. There's that 1% though that he will. Oh, okay. He's just blowing bubbles. Look at that bubble he made. Oh, shit. Look at this guy's afro. Oh, I guess it is a costume, but. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Did he just get, like, cut in half? What the? Oh, no. Oh, my God. He's just watching these innocent people get destroyed. Baldy. Oh, is he gonna take the eye? Oh, he's taking the eye fold off. <laughs> this is all you've got. <laughs> I told you, bro. Yeah, you're sweating. Bro, these guys got the shittiest plan. Yeah, I mean, like, you can't hold out for at least 20 minutes. Okay. Is that the end of the episode? Yeah. Okay. I mean, I get it. Like, from their perspective, it's not the worst plan ever. But here he is, like, they're murdering people, and he's, like, not even phased. How much do we really know about Gojo? Like, does he really even... I guess he doesn't care that much about people. Like, he'll do it out of obligation, but, like... Huh, I don't know. I guess maybe we'll learn more about him right here, his morals, but uh, it kind of seems like to me he's more in for it for the thrill of just fighting. Because when you're all powerful, like, you just want to, like, flex your muscles, you know? I'm going to forward to the uh, little bit at the end. Yay! I don't get these, but a Shibuya incident gate open. Okay. All right, that was a 
Interesting. Okay, so there's more. It's, it's there's Shibuya incident, and now there's like another part Shibuya incident. I wonder if they'll all be titled Shibuya something. I don't know. But that was uh, one of the two episodes I'm gonna watch today. I'm gonna watch the next one right now, and that'll be the newest one. I think that just came out yesterday. So I'm excited. Uh, this episode was okay. Like I kind of expected more. I thought that bug fight was pretty lame. Not gonna lie. And I don't like how everyone was like, "Oh, you beat this guy! Wow, you're." You're a grade one. Like, that guy didn't look that strong. He looked kind of shitty, honestly. But, uh... And then Gojo, these these guys are all, like... They have to buy 20 minutes to fight Gojo. Can't wait to see him just go off on him. Alright, well, hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, stay tuned for the next one. Until next time, it's been Mighty Gazelle. Thank you all have a mighty day. See you guys.